Um, hello everyone, uh, here's me again, my name is Chad, uh, today I'm gonna show you one of my uh, tools, like this tool will help you to uh, build some uh, controls based on the uh, based on based on the drones that you uh, created, and those uh, control will follow some certain um, geo that you selected. So uh, the script is like this. Once you uh, open it, you can see the small window like this. This window is uh, pretty straightforward. So the first section, you just need to type in the a prefix you that you want and then select the follow geo the following geo means the the geo that you want to uh want the controls to follow or uh you can see that it's actually the 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 geo that gonna uh we're gonna the, the geo that we're gonna copy is uh skin with to the following um uh surface surface uh, surf, uh, sorry yeah, surface. Uh, here you can select it if it, you want like F key mode or I key mode. Uh, so this section, like you need to select a unfollow joint. That means when you turn off the following function, uh, which uh, joint you want the, all the control to be followed. And the last one is uh, the you need to select one joint that based on this joint, this uh, the position. Uh, we're gonna create another shape of for the uh, another uh, sorry another control with different shape, and it has the uh, switch to turn on and off the following function. Okay, so let's do it uh, like this. So, uh, for example, if we want uh, rig this skirt, so we want add some uh, sub joints uh, like around this uh, whole thing around this two leg so like uh if we just uh, rig it like this uh just copy the skin to this one okay. like even you smooth this section you still gonna have some intersection with the leg when it has like a big movement and also, you, uh, the animator doesn't have like a uh, sub control to change the intersect to to fix intersection or change the shape. So this one is a really short one. If we have if the character has a, like a really long skirt, sometimes we're gonna flip the edge of the uh, the, sk the skirt. So um, if in that way, then I think. Uh, we need to build some uh, FK uh, FK based uh, controls, so that will give the the uh, the, the animators the, the option to change the shape. So let's go back and uh, remove this uh, skin skin node. So we just gave it uh, like a, some random name. And we want use this legs uh, uh, skin weight, so we load it here. We want to use FK, and uh, for the unfallen joint, we want to use this one. Okay, uh, so now we can start to build some joints. I just select uh, the this edge and I just convert it into the. Uh, uh, the curve so I just uh, uh, rebuild it then I uh, have another tool to uh, okay, maybe we can create it like four so this tool will just create four joints based on this uh, selected curve and the space will be even. Uh, oh, okay. So, if you are seeing it start from the bottom and end from the top, that means you need to reverse this uh, reverse this curve. So, let's, we can do this one first. Uh, clean the history and uh, do it again. We just need to. Uh, we just need to clean uh, the outliner a little bit. Did it this. 
but you can also do it manually like uh, do it do it do the like the joints manually one by one okay then I'm gonna use the last joint as the actually follow joint load it here uh, before I do that I will just uh, do the orientation So I select all of them and just run the script. Oh, sorry, what happened? Object, uh, okay. Oh, it's just loaded again. FDT, uh, this one, uh, this. Okay, so it worked. Come, it's so slow. Oh, it's it's not wait. Hmm? Oh, sorry, I didn't select all of the joints. Uh, I need to select all of them and just run it. Okay. So now we can see here is the FK chain. Okay, normal FK. And each of the FK control, it has the sub control. So if you're just moving the sub control, it, it will like work like an IK control. Now, uh, if we're lifting this leg, you can see actually it's uh, uh, kind of touching, like staying on top of the uh, leg. So all the movement will be the same as the legs. And the same time, it is still FK based. So this is the attribute uh, control that the we have this function, sorry, this is switch to turn off this following. Okay, so it, it is uh, like a float. Uh, attribute so you can just half you can turn half down just leave like a 0 0.5 or something then it will just f follow half of the movement and if you are turning on this unfollow uh, switch so it won't follow the uh, legs movement but it will only follow this joints movement. So if we're moving this, you can see it's actually following. But if you turn it on, I uh, turn it off. Sorry, uh, it will all act like the the lag. So once we build all the uh, joints for the skirt. And we just do the scheme for that. Then we are gonna have like safe, same, uh, same movement with the leg, and also we have the FK control on top of it. So we have like a, a sub control to change the shape, or like even do some animation, flip the le uh, the the edge, or clean up the intersections for uh, later simulation. Um, yeah, I think that's uh, pretty much what I have for this too. So, uh, if you like it, just uh, um, if you want it, so please let me know and leave your uh, email, uh, and then I can just send the script to you. And for the former video, uh, that script is uh, for the uh, for our company, so I can now really send it out to uh, anyone. Uh, and it, it is still uh, in the testing step so once we have like a better version and uh, uh, I can apply that to like send it out to everyone and thank you for uh, liking those uh, tools and uh, uh, please uh, please leave your uh, email address and I can just send you the whole script like uh, i mean for this one uh as soon as i uh, see the message thank you